By popular demand of our viewers, we base this episode solely on electric scooters that are sold in the US. No longer will Americans have to envy European and Asian buyers when it comes to affordable and efficient personal mobility vehicles. So to everyone demanding a comprehensive buying guide into the worthy e-scooters to buy in the USA, we present this detailed top 10 list. Let's get technical. Under development since the release of the BMW Concept Link in 2017, the new Maxi Scooter from BMW's Motorrads USA branch is now ready to hit the roads in early 2022. The production model gets a liquid-cooled electric motor with a maximum output of 42 horsepower, while its flat energy battery pack is rated for 8.9 kilowatt hour and is located under floor. This powertrain can supply zippy 0 to 30 mile per hour acceleration time of 2.6 seconds and reach the top speed of 75 miles per hour. The riding range is expected to reach 80 miles. The two-wheeler gets U and C-shaped LED lighting, a single-sided swing arm, and a rear shock. It's also fully connected to the rider and is smart tech with the 10.25 inch display, the largest in the scooter segment. California's Onyx RCR is quite an ambiguous product. It keeps bike pedals and a train to qualify as a moped, but at the same time has 60 miles an hour top speed that would place it in the category of a lightweight motorcycle. Built around a steel frame, the bike has an in-house developed forged aluminum front suspension and 350 millimeters adjustable shocks in the rear. This EV is sold with 23 and 41 ampere hour battery packs, enabling the max range up to 75 miles. The rear hub motor peaks at 8 horsepower and accelerates the bike to 31 miles per hour in 4 seconds. Additionally, you can equip the RCR with the DRT off road kit that includes front and rear fenders, a headlight grill, a rear rack, and fork vest covers. Each Onyx model is hand-built to order and has estimated delivery time of 2-4 to four weeks to 48 lower states. The Beijing-based Niyu has seen its sales skyrocket, posting 100% growth year after year and actually beating Tesla by the number of vehicles sold. From the beginning, the company chose to stay away from lead-acid batteries in favor of lithium-ion packs that would power the Bosch motors with 93% efficiency. Today, Niu is rapidly expanding in Europe and has nearly 40 dealers and premium stores in North America. Their lineup is represented by seven models within U-key, M-key, and N-key lines. These makes can have from 40 to 87 miles of range. 30 through 45 miles per hour top speed and weight from 159 to 242 pounds. The rider's safety and comfort are ensured with hydraulic disc brakes with CBS system, 360 degree LED lighting, cruise control, GPS tracking, and three axis movement detection alarm. It's time to give a boost to electric vehicles by smashing the like button. Thanks for the feedback and let's keep rolling. Manufactured by the Pennsylvania-based startup Jigsaw Electronics, the Buzzsaw Boss Hog Chopper targets those customers who prefer the style of the old and big mean-looking chopper cycles but do not like the amount of CO2 they emit. The Jigsaw Scooter boasts a truly hypnotic one-piece tubular metal frame with an empty space underneath. Its removable 1.8 kWh battery is positioned lower to the ground on the front-mounted tubular skid. The pack can feed the electric motor for nearly 50 miles of range and can help you accelerate to 50 miles per hour. For a suspiciously attractive pre-order price, the bike comes with hydraulic disc brakes, LED headlights, puncture-resistant tubeless tires, and an LED dashboard.
Introduced in summer 2021, the India Ola S1 electric scooter is now confirmed for a US launch next year. The model is powered by a permanent magnet motor rated for a continuous output of 7.5 horses and a peak torque of 43 pound-feet, while its range reaches 75 miles. A slightly tuned S1 Pro gets the same powertrain but can accelerate to 71 miles per hour instead of 56 and can cover over 110 miles. According to the brand, however, Ola's key competitive advantage is the number of features included for the asking price. These are all LED lighting, a 7-inch touchscreen with built-in navigation, smartphone pairing, and a digital key feature. The Pro model additionally benefits from cruise control and a voice assistant. The highest standard of emission-less mobility from Germany is set by Kumpan's lineup of scooters that follow the new look and feel technology and design concept. The range is represented by 54 Inspire, 54 Ignite, 54 Impulse, and the upcoming 54 Iconic scooters. These get not one, not two, but three removable batteries with the powerful LG cells labeled Power Pack 2.0. The 4 kilowatt motor gets enough juice to travel 84 miles on average, and the charging process takes just 4 hours from a standard home plug. Hydraulic fork and shock absorber ensure adequate cushioning, and hydraulic brakes front and rear provide excellent stopping power that you might need at the speeds up to 28 miles per hour. You can look into the heart of the Kumpan through its 7-inch touch display, but the telemetry module allows tracking the scoot status through your smartphone. In 2022, the UK-based Zap will be trying to tap into the growing US personal mobility market with their new i300 model. This sit-down scooter has a comfortable step-through design with chromoly steel frame, a single-sided swing arm, and an exoskeleton seat structure. The two-wheeler is offered in two versions, base and launch editions. Both get composite bodywork that is completed using no oven, no autoclave technology. In the case of the latter, the panels are from carbon fiber. The drivetrain system enjoys efforts of a permanent magnet electric motor, rated for 25 horses and 53 pound-feet peak, and two battery packs hidden within the scooter's floor. These are removable and are good for 60 miles per hour speeds and 37 miles of riding. The latest scooter from the Canadian Daymac has the look of a tourer but the soul of a daily commuter. The model accommodates two passengers with its dual seat, gets a large storage case at the rear, and features bright LED lights. The Berlin's drivetrain is represented by a 500 watt motor and a lead acid battery with 1.2 kilowatt hour capacity. It can propel the scoot up to 20 miles per hour and ensures 25 miles of traveling. You can choose between three color options, while standard tech includes keyless start, alarm, and a 7-inch digital display. Since 2018, the all-electric Vespa has been one of the few scooters of its kind available for purchase in North America. The two-wheeler shares beautiful retro styling with its ICE siblings, especially the Primavera, while its drivetrain components are all new. The power comes from a single motor rated for 5.4 horses that is juiced by a 4.2 kilowatt-hour lithium-ion battery pack. The latter promises 62 miles of riding and can recharge in 4 hours. 
In the US, this Vespa is offered in two variants. As standard, the top speed is capped at 30 miles per hour, but for an extra 100 bucks, you can get it raised to 45 miles per hour. The scooter also features regenerative braking, a 4.3 inch TFT dashboard, and a built-in GPS tracking system. The California-based CSC Motorcycles is an importer and distributor of electric bikes and scooters, as well as ICE motorcycles. The company's most recent introduction is labeled Monterey, after a famous bay in California. Offered in three coast-ready paint schemes, the two-wheeler rides on 17-inch wheels, offers ample underseat storage, and comes fitted with a full suspension system with an inverted hydraulic fork up front and dual shocks at the rear. A single 3 horsepower motor battery can propel the scoot to 30 miles per hour, while depending on your riding style, the range will vary from 20 to 60 miles. Finally, the model can carry two riders, though their combined weight should not exceed 330 pounds. What do you think about electric scooters that Americans get to buy? Will any of these models get onto your shopping list? We can talk this over in the comments section. Let's charge into the electric revolution together. So like and subscribe not to miss the upcoming review of electric vehicles. You can watch more videos about awesome EVs through the links in front of you. See you soon.